Good morning, everyone, and welcome to my 2016 morning routine. These routines are always highly requested, so I'm super excited to be filming for you today. This is very realistic. I wake up with greasy skin and crazy hair, and yeah, this is what I do on a daily basis. So the first thing I do when I wake up is look for my phone. Sometimes it's in my bed. Sometimes it's on my nightstand, but today... It's on the floor charging. I always open up Snapchat first. I'm addicted to Snapchat, as is everybody else. Um, you can find me on there, Trisha on YT. I'm always using those crazy filters. And I do snap people back, and I always send them the ugliest selfies ever. So if they post it, I know exactly who posted it, because I send different selfies to everybody. But I don't really care. It's Snapchat. They disappear, right? Quote, unquote. <laughs> And then I always order some breakfast. I've been loving Starbucks from the Postmate app, and I always get some coffee or like a sandwich or something. And then I realize I need to get my face washed and my body showered because it just won't happen if I just don't do it first thing in the morning. So I do a little sniff, and I'm like, mm, Trish, get that butt out of bed. <laughs> and so I go into the bathroom, do my business because I feel like everybody does this first thing in the morning. And then I grab some fresh towels to take a shower. Getting in the shower is always the hardest part, but once I'm in there, I'm like, oh, it's like heaven. I take the longest showers ever. I do have a full shower routine. I will link below. But I put that shower on super hot because I love hot showers. And yeah, these are the products that I'm currently using. For shampoo and conditioner, I use the Caviar Moisture Shampoo and Conditioner. I got the liters off of Amazon. And then the Nivea Men Skin Shaving Foam for my shaving needs. And I have been loving this Michael Todd Sonic Clear Elite, literally the Rolls Royce of Sonic Systems. It's just the Holy Grail product. The big head is for your body. I put it on the lowest speed, but it does have three different speeds for you. It keeps my skin so soft. I use this every day. I swear to goodness, my skin has never felt more amazing. So I keep that little buddy in there. It's waterproof as well, so safe for the shower. Then I Q-tip those ears, which always feels so good. And I do a little pose because I do this every day, not. <laughs> and then I put some deodorant on the Old Spice Extra Fresh Men's Deodorant. is amazing. You will not stink. And then my Postmate arrives with my coffee and my sandwich. My coffee is an iced chai tea latte, light ice. Um, and then my favorite part of the day is just watching YouTubes and eating. I have been watching a lot of uh, Something Rotten clips. This is from their White House performance with Christian Borrell. And then I also like the Brian Darcy James and him tap dancing. Um, thumbs up this video if you're a Broadway nerd. I am a Broadway nerd. I will like look up like clips from shows that... I want to see, but I can't because I live in LA. You New Yorkers are very lucky you have live theater. Um, so I just do that for a little while, and I, sometimes I edit, but now I'm just going to close up my laptop to finish up my skincare routine for the day. And I basically just keep it really simple while I brush my teeth first. But my skincare routine has gone down tremendously. And again, it's from this little sonic uh, brush that I was using earlier in the shower. I just remove the body brush, and then I replace it with the face brush, which is a little smaller. And there are three speeds for this brush. I put mine on low speed for both the standard sonic cleansing and the C Boost because I do have sensitive skin. But the C Boost is great because it does rejuvenate your skin and stimulates it in a different kind of way. So it does reduce how much of the work you have to do for your skincare. And then the cleanser I use is also by Michael Todd. It's this charcoal detox. And mine's for oily skin. They have um, different skin types. And this has honestly been the holy grail lifesaver for me. My skin has just repaired itself. And I just, I honestly... I don't get as much acne. I just really love it. And this is really the only step I use. I don't really use a toner afterwards because it just kind of cleanses my skin and clears it out. And I really, really like that. So I just take a pump on my fingertips and I massage it into my skin all around. And I start on my cheeks. And then I do switch hands when I want to apply it to the other side of my face. Um, just, you know... I don't know why. It's like a superstition to keep my face clear, but then I move it on up to my forehead and try and avoid the eye area when using this little device. And you just do it around in a circular motion. It does have little beeps that tells you when you should switch it around and also when you should stop. And yeah, I just really like this part. It's really, it just feels like you're at a spa, like just getting a facial. And it's kind of great. It's just like this at-home facial, inexpensive, really easy to use. And it's just like kind of like my meditation time. Get that skin cleared. The cycle lasts about two minutes with a beep every 20 seconds. And you can use this every day or every other day to just cleanse your skin, condition it, and it won't dry it out or irritate it, which again is great because I use other like acne kind of products and it always like irritates my skin after some time. So. so I just finish it up, circle it all the way around, and that's it for my skincare routine. Pretty simple. Then I have my Glam Squad come over. Um, this is not a daily thing, but if I have an event to go to or if I'm filming videos or something like that, I 
have them come over, do my hair and makeup, and we always like to Snapchat and have the craziest time. Um, hair is Prince Angel 1987 on Instagram, um, Juicy G713. He does my hair when Angel can't, and then my makeup girl is Ash K Home. They all have YouTube channels too, and they're all on Instagram. I'll link everything below because they just make me so happy. So as you can see, I started out with short hair in the morning, and he's just clipping in my Bellamy hair extensions. Um, I kind of just wear those when I want my long hair to give my hair a break because I don't wear extensions every day. Thumbs up this video if you want to see them do some tutorials on hair and makeup because I'm convincing them and I think they're going to do it. But I think if you thumbs it up, they'll do it for sure. <laughs> Wait, okay, go. Okay, go. <laughs> and then go forward. Oh. Oh. Hey. Mm -hmm. Hey. <laughs> 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 Glam. Oh, I feel like Britney Spears. Now are you sure you want a piece of me? <laughs> getting into character. Then once I become all pretty and transformed, I have to take some selfies for Instagram. They always take pictures too of me, but I always take some selfies because I feel like, you know, best angle is the selfie angle. So follow me on Instagram, at Trisha Paytas, if you want to see glams of the day. I always post them on there and always tag the peeps that help me out. Then I set up for filming. Yes, it doesn't take long for me to set up. I just sit on my couch. There's a little BTS, um, a little point of view of Trish and the cam. Uh, yeah, this is the Canon Rebel T3i for those who want to know. I've had it for seven years and it's never failed me. It's amazing. Then I always stock up on liquids before filming. So I'm grabbing my coffee from the fridge, do a little dance, get loosened up. And then, of course, have to pose for that thumbnail, though. I don't know. The thumbnail always looks better. Posing for it is awkward. And then it's like... Yep, yeah, there, okay, got it, good, okay, done. <laughs> um, then I set up, I focus, I get all my things around. I'm actually filming my monthly favorites here in this video. Hey guys, hey everyone, today I'm doing my monthly favorites, blah, blah, blah. You get the idea. Then I wrap it up and <gasps> you're watching me. Why are you watching me? Just kidding. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you do and you wanna see more routines. I wanna say hi to Rick Moranis and until next time, here are my kisses for my little Baby fishies. Can I do the lips today? There you go. Bye, guys.